Hi, I'm David. Let's look at this problem. We're given the points 3, negative 4, and 5, 2, and we're asked to find the slope of the line that passes through these two points. Well, in this case, it's probably easiest just to plot the two points and look at the line that connects them. So let's plot the point 3, negative 4. That's 3 in the x direction, 1, 2, 3, and 4 in the negative y direction. So down here, here's negative 4. So if I got if I go 3 over and 4 down, that point's right about there. That's the point 3, negative 4. Well, let's plot the point 5, 2. I go 5 over in the x direction and 2 up in the y direction, and I have this point right here. That's the point 5, 2. Now there's a straight line that connects the two. And it would keep on going forever that way and forever that way. Um, now, I want to find the slope of this straight line. Well, the slope is equal to rise over run, or the change in y over the change in x. Let's just look at our picture and look at from this point to this point, what's the change in y and what's the change in x? So I could kind of draw this little, this little triangle right here. And I could see, well, the change in y how much did it change in the y direction? It went down to negative 4 and up to 2. Well, that distance is 6. So the change in y must be 6. Well, I could look at the change in x. How far did I change in the x direction from this point to this point? Well, I changed from 3 to 5. That's a change of 2. Well, 6 over 2 is equal to 3. And I look at that and I think to myself, well, this definitely looks like a positive steep slope. A slope of 3 makes a lot of sense. So in this case, the slope of this line is 3. Thanks for watching.